Welcome back to the channel, nephew the boss. No, I'm just kidding. Welcome back to the channel, it's nephew. All right, check out Chesapeake Energy. You know, on this channel, we talk about stocks that have the potential to make 100%, 2, 3, 4, 5, 100%, 50%, 20%, stuff like that. And sometimes we just discuss stocks anyway, just to see if there's any potential in it. And, and this is one that I, I used to trade, but I just wanna see what you guys think about this one. It's a penny stock. I told you I don't really deal with these, but this one, uh, I'm just kind of confused about it. So I want to see like, uh, I want to see what this one is capable with. I just want to see what you guys think. So this is Chesapeake. Here's the all chart. It's been around for a long time. Um, here's it at $30 a share. Okay. Here's it at $35 a share. Here's it at $60 a share. Here is it at 32. Now let's see. It's been down to 37 cent before. It's been down to 8 cent before, back in 94. And it went all the way up to $30. Uh, let's see. So this one, boom, boom, boom. $8 a share. It's pretty good too. Uh, here's another peak. Just looking like Bitcoin, the way it do that. $36 a share. Came all the way back down to 15. Went all the way back up to 30. That's 100% right there. Came back down to 16, went all the way back up to 30. That's another 100% there. Then came all the way down to $2, went back up to five or six. That's a two or 300% there. And just a lot of times, just this, this has done that historically. It's, this thing does that, you know what I mean? So I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying, I'm not saying it's going to keep doing that. I'm just looking, guys, you know. Um, on this channel, I, you know, tell me if I'm wrong. Tell me if I'm making a mistake. Tell me if you think I'm stupid, whatever you think. Drop a comment below. Let me know. Um, this stock right here is so cheap, like to buy, right? So I'm looking at a 45 cent share and I'm at a point where on the chart it's looking like either this thing is going to go right into bankruptcy or this thing is going to do a reversal somewhere down the line. I don't think that they can stay under a dollar for too long. Um, let me see. How long has it been under a dollar? Uh, it's been under a dollar since... Um, why is my thing not working? Here it is. Okay. Uh, we got down to a dollar right there in October 19. Yeah. I mean, you know, per rules, New York Stock Exchange rules, I don't think they can stay under a dollar for so long. So at some point, they got to get it back over a dollar. I don't know if they're going to do reverse split and do all that crazy paperwork type magic stuff or if they just gonna get some investors or sell some debt or i don't know what they're gonna do but um just judging from the chart here i mean and for the price i mean i'm gonna buy a couple of these because i would love for this to go back up to i would love for this to go back up to like what's this thirty dollars a share from 40 cent 32 dollars i mean i ain't i'm not even expecting this this dreaming right here going all the way to 60. i'd be happy if it go to right here if it go to 15 and 10 dollars this year i'd probably be happy so i'm i'm gonna buy this with the intent to just do that with my spare change like how i was doing the, the Deutsche coin like with stuff that's that cheap i just use spare change for that you know what i mean so i, I invest in this type of stuff with the chip money Money I was gonna buy chips with stuff like that. I just buy this instead. Like every time I think about it, like you know what, every dollar could end up being sixty dollars with this because it's fifty cents, forty five cent per share. So every one dollar could turn into like thirty dollars. Let's put it like that, or say sixty dollars. Yeah, because it's two shares for every one dollar. So if it go to thirty dollars a share, then every dollar you spend can can go up sixty, like sixty times. So that's that's a lot of you know, that's a lot, man. To me, that's a lot of that's a lot of flips. 60 flips there's like six thousand percent right i mean you know i'm just saying you know so i mean um you know 60 times is a lot man so i'm i'm gonna i'm gonna put some you know i'll throw a hundred at it that's it i could throw a hundred at it it's some some simple like a hundred dollars because a hundred dollars will get you uh 200 shares or something right so it's like 200 shares and then at, at $30 a share, pfft, that's a lot. 
<laughs> for for a hundred bucks, you know what I'm saying? For something small like that. So I'm just going, I don't know what's going to do, but I got a hundred dollars that I'm willing to risk to find out. I just buy it and leave it there. Um, so I don't know. I just want to know if there's anybody out there that's buying this, that's holding on to this. Drop a comment below. Let me know what you're doing. Let me know if you saw this, if you're doing this same thing. I, I don't know. Is this just going to is this going bankrupt? Like it's done it before. It's been here. Look, it's been this far down before. It was at 30. It was at 40 percent. It was at this is the lowest it ever been. And then after that, it went back up. And whoever had it was happy. I'm saying whoever bought it right here, February 1999. Whoever bought this, then rolled it up here, was a happy camper. Especially if they rolled it all the way up here, like this. And maybe this was just hype. But I mean, if you held it from, you know, 40 cent all the way to 61 cent, and let's assume you had a thousand shares, we've had a thousand shares. That's five hundred dollars worth. You have a five hundred dollars worth of shares, and then ride all the way back up to sixty. Maybe I'm just dreaming, but even if you go to thirty, that's a lot. Five hundred times thirty. You know, let me know in the comments what that is. Smash my like button, hit the subscribe button. I'm just, I just be looking at these charts, and I just wanted to bring this one up. Let me know what you're doing. There's probably people looking at this. If you saw this, let me know. And I'm not, you know, I'm not professional. I can't tell you what to buy. I, I'm just telling you what I'm finna buy. Yeah, I'm gonna buy some of this. It's not like I'm going to hurt myself if I buy it. I'm going to make a couple day trades and throw three, four hundred in there and call it a day and just hold on to it forever. Just never sell it. You know what I mean? I'm never going to sell it. Just hold on to it. When this get up to about $15 a share, I probably sell 30% of the shares I got. I already made my profit. And then if it continue to go up, just keep on riding it up. You know what I'm saying? But all right. Talk to you guys later. Peace.